built by Four, incredibly three, smart engineers. Two, one. Fight, robots, hey, fight. Go. Good fast start here for Megatron. So far, Megatron able to shrug off some of these hits, but it has to be so careful in his driving. He cannot rush into this. Now, this was a fight that Chonky had anticipated earlier uh, in, in the, the day. I saw it yesterday. This is a special configuration specifically for There it is. That's Megatron. the moment Jamison needs to jump on, and he does. He needs to stay, keep the pressure going, and he's trying. Really what you need to do is slow down the shell somehow, smash it up against uh, the house bot or against the rail, and then come in and try and get it onto his head. Here we go. He's going to control this. He's going to try and hit the top. He does. Now, if he could cleave through that self-riding bar, that would make this job a whole lot easier. It absolutely would. Now, Luke, he's got to stay on top of this. Megatron is already showing Probably 75% compromise on his front plow. That does not have a lot of hits left. Looks like a big tiger claw just right across the front of the plow on Megatron. Now, we saw a little smoke earlier. It may be that that's the weapon on Chunkiv. Uh, it doesn't seem to be spinning up. It could be that Jameson's just keeping them on the ropes. We don't know yet. Yeah, that shell is not spinning up on Chunky. That said, that whole shell is a tank. It is armored the full way around. Even with 100 hits, it's going to be hard for Megatron to really get a lot of penetration here. A minute 20 left here before we crown a Golden Brett winner here in the 30s. Jameson Go would love to add a second Golden Brett to his trophy case here for Megatron. I see a little bit of smoke coming out of the top of Chonkiv. Uh, there's a chance that they could work their way off, spin a bit, use that to kickstart their weapon. We've seen that a few times from uh, big shell spinners, but the more smoke you see, the less chance of that happening. This is the most damage that we've seen Chonky take in the, uh, the competition here today. You can see that self-riding arm starting to get caved in. Match here's pause. Yeah, they are hooked together. They can't free from one another, so uh, our cage staff is going to do that for us. To happen now. If it doesn't, then this is a hundred percent Megatron's game. It will take a miracle. All right, that shell has not come back yet on Chonky. That's a lot of movement, but not a lot of movement of the shell. In yeah. fact, it may well be seized up. Normally, you'd at least see it spinning uh, passively. Yes. Uh, and we are not seeing any of that. Yeah, exactly. It's it's making connection um, with Megatron, uh, bumping up against the rail. You would see it spinning freely. Yeah, you can. Granted, remember, you. Oh, this is interesting. Remember, if uh, the two get entangled again, or rather, if Megatron can't uh, undo its pin a second time, that could be a problem for Megatron. It's going to try awfully hard. It does. It succeeds. Uh, but yeah, that could, we're coming down to the last 10 seconds here. This is gonna go to a judge's decision, but that was a pretty dominant performance from Jameson Go and Megatron. I think that Megatron will be going home tonight with a second Golden Brett. Winning the Golden Brett in 2021, very likely winning the Golden Brett here in 2024. Jameson Go showing that this unconventional design has